Nairobi National Park is a national park in Kenya that was established in 1946 about 7 kilometers 4.3 miles south of Nairobi. It is fenced on three sides, whereas the open southern boundary allows migrating wildlife to move between the park and the adjacent Kaitangla Plains. Herbivores gather in the park during the dry season. Nairobi National Park is negatively affected by increasing human and livestock populations, changing land use and poaching of wildlife. Despite its proximity to the city and its relative small size, it boasts a large and varied wildlife population, and is one of Kenya's most successful rhinoceros sanctuaries. Nairobi National Park is the main tourist attraction for visitors to Nairobi. Visitor attractions include the park's diverse bird species, cheetah, hyena, leopard, and lion. Other attractions are the wildebeest and zebra migrations in July and August, the ivory burning site monument, and the Nairobi Safari Walk and Animal Orphanage. Inhabitants of Nairobi visit the park and thousands of Kenyan children on school field trips visit the park each week. The park's Wildlife Conservation Education Center has lectures and video shows about wildlife and guided tours of the park and animal orphanage. These tours are primarily, but not exclusively, to educate schools and local communities. There has been criticism about animals' housing, and they now have more spacious housing in a more natural environment. The Kenya Wildlife Service has created a safari walk that highlights the variety of plants and animals that are in Kenya, and how they affect Kenya's population. The park covers an area of 117.21 square kilometers 45.26 square miles and is small in comparison to most of Africa's national parks. The park's altitude ranges between 1,533 and 1,760 m, 5,030 and 5,774 feet. It has a dry climate. The park is the only protected part of the Athikopitae ecosystem, making up less than 10% of this ecosystem. The park has a diverse range of habitats and species. The park is located about 7 kilometers 4.3 miles from the Nairobi center. There is electric fencing around the park's northern, eastern, and western boundaries. Its southern boundary is formed by the Mbagathai River. This boundary is not fenced and is open to the Kaitangla Conservation Area, located immediately south of the park, and the Athikopitae Plains. There is considerable movement of large ungulate species across this boundary. Nairobi National Park slash Nairobi Kenya National Park is the first park to be gazetted in Kenya on December 16, 1946. The park is located about 7 kilometers 4.3 miles south of Nairobi in Kenya, and it's the only wildlife park in the world that is so close to the city. The park covers an area of 117 square kilometers, on 45 square miles and lies about 5,000 to 6,000 feet, 1,500 to 1,800 meters, above sea level. Nairobi National Park consists partly of thick woods near the city outskirts, partly of rolling plains and valleys, and partly of wooded confluence of several rivers, its vegetation is of the dry transitional savanna type. Acacias and other thorny varieties, muhu, cape chestnut, and Kenya olive are the most important trees that acts as habitat for the wildlife in the park. Nairobi National Park is the major rhino sanctuary for breeding and restocking other parks, the park is a home of over 100 mammal species having four of the big five, lion, buffalo, leopard, rhino, other animal species include the zebra, black rhinoceroses, giraffe, various species of antelope well as numerous reptiles and among others in the park to thrill while on Kenya wildlife tours. And also the park has a spectacular wildebeest and zebra migration. Nairobi National Park has over 500 recorded bird species at least 20 of which are seasonal European migrants, some of the bird species in the park includes the secretary bird, lesser kestrel, martial eagle, pallid harrier, sooty falcon, white-bellied bustard, grey-crowned crane, corn crake and many others. Nairobi National Park has the Nairobi Animal Orphanage, 
founded in 1963 which is located inside the park which serves treatments and rehabilitation center for wild animals like the lions, cheetahs, hyenas, jackals, servals, and among others also the bird species can be viewed including the parrots, guinea fowls, crowned cranes, ostriches and many others. The distance between Nairobi and Nairobi National Park is 15.6 kilometers through the A104 road which takes you about 28 minutes by the road means. Nairobi National Park is amazed with other attractions like the Ivory Burning Site Monument, walking trails at Hippo Pools, Nairobi Safari Walk and the Orphanage, spacious accommodating picnic, which makes Kenya safaris and Kenya tours to experience a number of tourists to visit Nairobi National Park due to various Nairobi National Park activities in the park. Despite its proximity to the city and its relative small size, it boasts a large and varied wildlife population, and is one of the Kenya's most successful rhinoceros sanctuaries. Nairobi National Park boasts 100 species of mammals, including 39 lions and 90 rhinos, 40 different amphibians and reptiles. The park has only four of the big five namely, buffaloes, lions, leopards, rhinos, minus elephants. Nairobi National Park has a spectacular wildebeest and zebra migration, the large predators in the park includes the lion, leopard, hyena, and cheetah. Other animal species in the park includes, giraffe, hippopotamus, blue wildebeest, plain zebra, Thompson's gazelle, Grant's gazelle, common eland, impala, hartebeest, water buck, common warthog, olive baboon, black backed jackal, common ostrich, and many others. Nairobi National Park is the only one in the world to be a home to wild animals while being part of a capital city, but Nairobi is one of the fastest growing metropolises in Africa, increasingly endangering the park in its midst. Nairobi National Park is a haven birding safari destination in Kenya where the park has over 500 bird species recorded, of which 20 are seasonal European migrants. Nairobi National Park probably Kenya's capital the longest bird list of all cities in the world making the best birding tour ever. The park's substantial area of undisturbed grassland is of great importance for species such as the restricted range Jackson's widow bird, which breeds here regularly after good rains, other grassland birds include the ostriches, secretary birds, and bustards. Many bird species in Nairobi National Park includes Abyssinian thrush, corncrakes, fishers lovebirds, grey-crowned crane, heart lobs bustard, Jackson's widow bird, cory bustard, lesser kestrel, marshall eagle, pallid harrier, white-bellied bustard, white-headed vulture and many others. November to April is when the migrants from Europe and North Africa are present then spectacular Jackson's widow bird displays from March to May. Kiferu Ark which means rhinoceros sanctuary for its successful role in rhino conservation, Kiferu means rhino in Swahili, it is the one of the Kenya's most successful rhinoceros sanctuaries, the purpose of Kiferu Ark is for the anti-poaching in the park, and it is one of the only a few parks that is Nairobi National Park with where visitors can be certain of seeing a black rhinoceros in its natural habitat. Nairobi National Park has the highest population of black rhinos, and a good population of the southern white rhinos and the eastern browse, black, rhino, dicerus bicorni micheli, in the wild these intelligent and affectionate creatures have inhabited the earth for 60 million years. Nairobi National Park is another great spot for the rhinos in Kenya. The park has 50 critically endangered black rhinos, the densest population in the world. Nairobi National Park is the convenient and virtually guaranteed chance to observe eastern black rhinos, of which only 700 remain after poaching decimated. The Ivory Burning Monument is a landmark symbolizing the conservation of the wildlife marking the exact site that the Kenya President Daniel Arap Moy burnt ivory as a way of sending a message to all the poachers to stop killing and abducting the wildlife, and stop ivory trade. Walking trails in Nairobi National Park that starts from a picnic area, following the Athai River banks. The route is patrolled by the Kenya Wildlife Service Rangers, and is one of a few areas in the Nairobi National Park where hiking is allowed without one. Nairobi National Park is a principal attraction for visitors to Nairobi and also serves many residents, as well as a successful rhino sanctuary, 
the park has an excellent record for supporting the species and nurturing them until they are relocated to their former range and to other upcoming sanctuaries. Nairobi National Park has the aggregations of large herbivores eland, buffalo, zebra, and wildebeest ivory burning site monument walking trails at Hippopus Nairobi Safari Walk and the Orphanage. Spacious Accommodating Picnic Nairobi Animal Orphanage is found inside Nairobi National Park which is another big attraction in the park that travelers can do and visit while in the park. The Nairobi Animal Orphanage is a treatment and rehabilitation center for wild animals like the cheetahs, lions, monkeys, and others once they are hurt say by poachers. The Nairobi Animal Orphanage is a great place to see wildlife up front, unlike when on a game drive. For travelers looking for a camping experience while on a Kenya safari in Nairobi National Park, in the park there are three public campsites with electricity, hot water showers and communal kitchens and tent hire services bat the main gate for those who don't have their own tents. For travelers who want a more camping experience other than pitching your own tent, this experience can be got from Nairobi Tented Camp located within the boundaries of the park on the west side. Nairobi Tented Camp is a luxury tented camp with nine luxurious permanent tents with ensuite bathrooms and solar lighting, the camp serves gourmet meals in the bush under the stars or in the dining tent. Accommodation in Nairobi National Park is got a wide range of safari lodges, safari hotels and camps which are categorized as luxury accommodation, mid-range accommodation, and budget accommodation. The park has three public campsites. They all provide electricity, hot water showers and kitchens. You can hire your own tent, if you don't have one already. Nairobi Tented Camp is the only official accommodation in Nairobi National Park. It is located in the west of the park, including nine luxurious permanent tents. Meals are served in the bush, under the stars, or in the dining tent. Water is heated over log fires. It is an experience you will never forget. The park is also close to the suburbs of Longata and Karen. They both offer a wide range of accommodation options, that vary from comfortable goose houses to five-star hotels. For nature lovers, Giraffe Manor is recommended. It is located on the grounds of the Giraffe Center in Longata. Besides 12 double rooms of grand colonial style, this option is extra special by the Rothschilds giraffes that walk freely around the grounds. Accommodating here also puts you within easy reach of other top Nairobi attractions. Nairobi National Park is situated in Nairobi the capital city of Nairobi, 7 kilometers south of the city center and is accessed using numerous entry gates such as Mase Gate, Mbagathai Gate, Bunda Gate, Longata Gate, and KWS Headquarters. To get to Nairobi National Park both road and air means of transport are used. By road by road it is approximately 7 km south of the city center and about 10 km from Yomo Kenyatta International Airport. By air, by air international tourists fly to Yomo Kenyatta International Airport and tourists on a combined safari can use domestic chartered flight to Wilson Airport then drive to the park. Thank you for watching this video.